So I have a job interview in about two minutes. We just Good, dependable, honest people, Jacob. That's all we're asking. Yeah, that's right up my alley. If everything goes well and I get hired, I'm gonna see how fast I can get fired. Hey, how's it going? Hello. Doing good, a hamster, huh? No, wait, what? I didn't order that. Is that really a hamster? You wanna see it? Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> Before we get into this video, I just want to say we did not run a Black Friday deal or a Cyber Monday deal. That being said, I want to make it up to you guys in the MILFs Only Gentlemen Club. Hoodies and t-shirts are now going to be 33% off. I'm telling you guys, I know they're a little pricey, but trust me, they are worth it. All these other YouTubers merchandise that you are buying, it's all gilded in the worst quality possible. Just so that way they can make the most money. Us though, we're trying to go quality over quantity and that is exactly what we're going to be doing. So if you guys love the grind and you want to support the videos, the link will be down in the description below. With that being said, let's go get from a job. I don't know what you heard about me. Okay, it has been a wild past couple weeks. Let me walk you guys through what has happened. If you guys have not been keeping up with my channel, two videos ago, a girl rear-ended my car and practically totaled it. Just got in an accident, some dude just rear-ended us. I can't tell, dude, if we're hurt or what. My car's fucked. Oh, dude, my head's actually kind of hurt. Dude, he's going over the curb. Is he drunk? Dude, he's got to be drunk. Not only did she total it, but she didn't have insurance or a driver's license, which means all the damages that were done to my car has to be paid completely out of my own pocket. So to prevent that from happening to anyone else, I went around my town and started a petition to revoke women's driver's licenses. Hey, I hate to disrupt your guys' meal, but I'm just doing a petition. I was wondering if any of you guys were interested in signing it. We're just starting a petition. We're trying to revoke women's driver's license. We're trying to revoke women's driver's license. <laughs> I'm really serious, because we need to revoke them to make the roads a safer place. Studies show that male drivers, male drivers that are three times the legal BAC are safer drivers than women that are sober. Uh, we're trying to revoke women's driver's license. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. You don't think? Are I was recently a victim. I, I swear to you. Are you kidding me? I promise you. Well, it's the little punks that or on my ass and the people that have trucks. Would you so. say it's more guys that are the bad drivers? Absolutely. Or you think? Harvard did a study that a gorilla is statistically better to drive than a sober woman in her right state of mind that aced her driver's test. Yeah, that's not been my experience. Like Harambe could probably make a U-turn better, you know? Yeah, it's a hard no. It wouldn't affect your generation, just her. She would probably have to Uber everywhere, Lime oh, Scooter. Sorry, right. you're talking to the wrong Please table. Please leave this table. Yeah. Okay, sorry about that. You guys have a, you guys, yeah. safe launch. Now, because my petition failed and I only got three signatures, I went to plan B and I started applying to jobs. As you guys know, I am not good at job interviews at all. Apparently, you can't vape while getting interviewed. So, like, are you like, I mean, are you just trying to like blow this job interview puffing this with like customers? I do blow. No, but you can't vape that in here. Oh, like this is a vape free zone? I didn't see a sign. It's, it's a, I normally look for the sign that says like vape free. Okay, I didn't. So it's like a restaurant, so I don't need a, a sign. That's a big no-no. So I hired some random dude off Fiverr to coach me on how to ace any job interview, on how to get any job I want. Can you see me? But you good? Perfect. But you good, Jacob? Yeah, I'm applying to be a okay. ho hotel front deskman. My main dream is to go to Australia and study wildlife. I'm huge into wildlife. Fantastic, mate. That's great. I can see, I can see, see the lines behind you when you come yeah, to that's, my, that's my wallpaper. <laughs> when you're ready, we'll, we'll go through the, uh, the 10 questions, just like you're in, in, you're in an interview. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. And then after we're finished, obviously I'll give you some feedback um, on each question or okay. just overall feedback. I've also got you a guide on how to prepare for an interview how to use the star techniques. Okay, yeah, wonderful. Yeah, I've worked at a hotel before, but this one's uh, the Ritz Carlton, so it's gonna be a lot more of a professional setting. So that's honestly like my main fear is like, I do have experience working at a hotel before, but I mean, just yeah. of the caliber of this hotel, you know, they're not gonna just hire anybody. So I wanna make sure, my virtual meeting is tomorrow at 9 a.m. my time. So I wanna really make sure yeah. that I, I am just as prepared as I possibly can be. Can you describe a situation where you've had to handle a difficult guest or a difficult customer. How did you address their concerns? One time, I thought my hotel was gonna get robbed because the dude who walked in was black. Okay. When that happened and I saw that black guy walk in, I immediately went to the worst case scenario and I had 911 on speed dial. And I'm not what one to be that? racist. I don't think I have a racist bone in my body at all. I like every race. Asians, blacks, 
Koreans, the normals. I just wanted to put that out there before people started saying that I was racist. After I went through job interview training, I felt pretty confident, so I went around and I asked if people are hiring. Just seeing if you guys are hiring. I'm trying to... Fill out an application on the bottom of our website. Oh, God. So I just got fired from PetSmart, so I'm trying to keep it in the same realm of what I'm good at. Okay. I got caught jerking it to Livy Dunn's leaks off Reddit in the back where the kibble is. So PetSmart let me go this week and I got bills to hey, pay. You're getting really good um, rep right away. Yeah, you're, you're, you're getting a good rapport with us. You're telling us all about how you're jacked off in PetSmart. I wouldn't say, I just stroked it. I wouldn't say I jacked off, just stroked it. We didn't finish. I'm sorry. You didn't finish? Well, no, I got caught because I was right next to the kibble. Okay, so good. You got all turned off by that. My old manager is kind of a cock block, so. Okay, I'll let Aiden know. Okay, could you just look out for my name? Yep. That's Jacob. What was yours? Anna. Anna. Oh, I shouldn't have touched your hand. No, I washed it. Don't worry. Okay, good. And I finally got one person to agree to give me a chance, and I had a real job interview with them. Let me tell you a little bit about what we got going on, Jacob. So my name's Wanda. I actually work for Colorado Hospitality here in Denver. So what we're looking for is we have some properties around town. We're looking for desk agents. We're looking for auditors. We just want good, dependable, honest people, Jacob. That's all we're asking. We want people to come in and do your job, go home, come back tomorrow. We can train people. We can show people but we need good, dependable, reliable. Yeah, that's right up my alley. After I secured the job, I still needed money, so Ryan and I, in the meantime, until I had my first day at work, went around town and we door dashed. I gotta pick up a door dash order. <laughs> For, sorry, what's the name? What's the name? Uh, Hannah Tao. There you go. Thank you. Uh, it's supposed to be 7.46. Cool, can I get um like the box you guys put hamsters in? Can I have a box? Um, I think that should be okay. Um, I'll go and ask one of the old Yeah, will you go ask real quick yeah. before I buy these cat toys? Yeah, no worries. Can, uh, a pet parent wants to know if we can get a spare hamster box. Is that cool? You just want, like, the smaller one, right? Yeah, whatever the normal hamsters come in. Yeah, just the smaller one. You love hamsters? What's that? Do you love hamsters? Yeah, no, I do. My favorite site is X Hamster. Really? Okay, cool. You just look it up. It's like a campaign for them. All types of hamsters. Cool. Gerbils, guinea pigs, even rabbits with Down syndrome. Sometimes they classify them as hamsters. Yeah, thank you so much, dude. Thank you. <clears throat> I just got a hamster. How I know. Bad boy. Hey, how's it going? Doing good. A hamster, huh? Yeah. No, wait. What? I didn't order that. I had a sign for it. Are you brief? What? What was the name? Mary. Was that the... I don't want a hamster. It's not mine. Uh... What I did you have? From White Chocolate Grill. Fuck, did the last people order the hamster? <laughs> Are you joking? No. That's hilarious, you gave them a pie. Oh, fuck. Is that really a hamster? You wanna see it? Yeah. It's kinda cute. I don't want it. I've, hey, had, guy. I've had everything. Hey, little guy, where is he? You can see him in there. You see him right there? Wait, let me see. You see him? Look at him. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> but you didn't order it because I can't, I seriously can't take this. No, I didn't order that. You have the pie. I do have the pie. I have, I bought pie from White Chocolate Grill. Fuck, what, not. Do I, what do I do with this then? A hamster. Just get, will you get rid of him for me? No. You're going to have to take care of it. I can't. I can't. I'm not financially like responsible enough. I can barely wipe my own ass, let I alone take care of a hamster. No. Speaking I, of which, can I use your guys' pisser? I, I got to pee so bad. Are you serious? It was a 25 minute drive. And oh, it took hi. a toll to get here. Okay, I'll let you pee. Should Is I just, this like a joke? Am should I we like get rid on of him? camera? No. no, we're not gonna get rid of it. He's That's so, so sad. Hey little guy. Are you kidding? Hey little guy. Why are you shaking it? We gotta get rid of him. Are you like playing a joke on me? No, don't be gentle with him. You just shook it. All right, be gentle with him. Is this a joke? No. Let me grab your pie, though. All right, will you hold him for me? All right, I don't trust you with him. 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 
It is currently 7 o'clock in the morning. My shift started at 7, so we're running a little bit late. You guys don't even understand what we had to go through to wake up this early. Yesterday was Thanksgiving. Ryan and I, we were drinking a little bit last night, so waking up this morning was a little bit hard, but we're still going to do it. First day at work, we're going to see how fast I can get fired. Ryan's going to go in there, sit down, eat some free breakfast from the hotel, and then I'm going to go in and start my first day at work. Hey, I'm just here for my uh, first shift. Jacob? Yeah. Uh, right this, uh, you want to come right around this way, right over here? Or that way? Okay. Do, do, do I go around? Okay. What is that? Oh, this is my gerbil. You bring, you have a gerbil for work today? Or? He gets separation anxiety. Okay. If you want to... He got diagnosed two years ago. His okay. name's Gail Lewis. Alright. Um, if you want to just, I guess, put it right down here. We're going to have you on this computer. Okay. I'm going to move mine over to here real quick. If you want to put him, like, probably right over here. He likes to get a room. good view sometimes. Hotels doesn't allow us to have stuff like that. Can I grab my water from the car? Go ahead. Yeah. <sighs> so you're drinking vodka? I'm just thinking right now it's really not going to work out. We can't have pets at work and stuff like that. Because of Gail Lewis? I just don't want to go forward right now, okay? Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. How's Gail Lewis going to get food? I'm sorry. We'll, uh, we're going to have to ask. I'm going to ask you to leave right now. This isn't going to work out. Sorry. This is a joke? No, I'm sorry, but if you could... Uh, I could I, I'll, I'll, dump, I'll dump this out. Can I get a room for tonight? I'm sorry, no. Gail Lewis, will you take care of her for me? Will you take care of her? What is that? It's a hamster. Oh, no. I just got let off. Easy, just leave, please. Fuck! <laughs> 